thrown. Take advantage of it. Take advantage of it. They'll get you thrown down and thrown into fit. They'll, they'll see that that you take your kindness as weakness. Yeah, they will. Yep. They'll take it as weakness, not love. And I've noticed I've, I've done that before with with Ed Mike. Gotten into a position where I got set up. You know what I mean? I'd have fought a, I'd have fought a hand mic. Two other hand mics jumped and they pulled a pistol on me. Damn. And had my jaw broken, everything. I fought him. Now, now six months later, he got smoked. Yeah. Because of the people that he deals with and how he deals. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Because the Bible says. I hit that nigga, he, went, he took off. <laughs> he took off. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, I, I nicked him. Because you had a knife in your hands. You know? I nicked him. <laughs> uh, he hit him with the Muhammad Ali uh, Look, the snapper punch. I nicked him. Punch. His hand was still busted over. He hit him I with the, him. Yeah, this, 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 the snapper punch. punch. The snapper punch. came immediately. He just took off, man. I'm going to tell you something, though. So now that I've seen that, and I can recognize and discern the difference between our people who are in the midst of the midst of I'm looking at our people, and I'm looking at what we like to absorb. You know, it ain't just our, it's all of us. We like to absorb negativity. We like the status of, well, you can't say we anymore, but there was a time where I was led astray. So. You know what? You can't say we because we got punished as a nation. We getting punished as a nation. <laughs> We ain't the reason why we ain't because right. of these no, people right here. All of us are sinners anyway. That's how I'm looking. We got Moses. Moses got put to death because of wicked ass. Well, he didn't get put to death. Yeah, he, he didn't make shit, it. Shit, he had to live with a hand mic. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, man. Right, right, I feel right. sorry for Moses. Right. Damn. <laughs> who, who else was like that? Wasn't it? Uh, who <laughs> who went to heaven? Uh, Isaiah went, went to the throne room, right? <laughs> and, he, and his mouth he had, his mouth was undone, right? Because yeah. the way he talked, he knew he was wicked. Yeah. So, you know, he had been talking with the hand mics and hanging out with the hand mics. Yeah. Man, you know, yeah. Moses yeah. couldn't yeah. wait to get out of there. Oh, Moses ran right there. Yeah, man, you, 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 you living amongst the the the, uh, the royal of the heathens? Right. Oh my goodness! Right. That's the spirit of like a, some of us, man. But Moses, because he gave us the riches, we can do man. We got skills to be do some great things in this world, like yep. we saw right yeah. earlier. With the music and the science and all that. Great things in this picture, world, man. Jay and Future and all of them. You seen that big picture? Oh man? yeah, with all the black built yeah. billionaires, well, looking like all looking that like mean. the royal, the royal hand. Looking like the royal hand in the few, you know, here and there. Now that picture, I was all Jake, I was all from Shem. They all, they all, they all from Israel, man. Let me he saw from Shem too. Now nah, he talking about the picture with Jay Z. Oh, I seen that picture. That meme that going around there. saying they all got that money. But no yeah. black community. No more. That's all Israelites. That's, that's just they, part. They that's, all sham though. They ain't I mean, Hamites. When you get your own face Hamites on your own money, no then then you. <laughs> Obama's a Hamite. They putting Harry Tubman on the. Is it Harry Oh, they gonna think they ain't the kingdom now, Is boy. They put Tubman? Harry. Yeah, I they think, think they think. Look, you know what they do? They think yes. that they, they think they're giving us some sort of restitution. Right, right, right. It's psychology. It's yeah, psychology. It's psychology. It's, psychology. Yeah. it's, it's, yeah. it's just like it's just like if you have a slave in a, yeah, in a yard, his hands for to get over and life. and all you feed him is pig entrails because he's hungry. If you give him ten dollars and open up the yard, yep. he's gonna think he's rich. Yep. So what yep. happens? What happens is they're giving men who have a slave mentality. Throwing a dog a bone. Throwing a dog a bone. And the thing is, and it, it's a woman. For her to be on there, she had to be a wicked ass woman. And she's a so woman that's not even a great male yeah. leader. You know, a man. So like that. a strong, a strong, like George Washington, he's on the dollar bill to most use money, right? He's a great war hero, a general. So they ain't gonna put nobody, no Israelite man like that on the money. A great war hero, you know, a they warrior, a warrior. That's you know, Obama. They went through. Oh, they, they gonna put they up, Obama gonna lengths. get it. They go, went through great lengths in a time. He gonna get on the fifty to, to bury the lineage. And, I mean, you read Psalm eighty three. Yep. They went through great lengths. Then they started then trying to bury the lineage. You get what I'm saying? That's so, what the Freemasons was all about. Hey, who you oh, say yeah. was a hammer? Oh, yeah. the Hiram was right in there. Yeah. Oh, he's a hammer. Yeah. Like, Hiram. You know, yeah. And you know, he's a, not only was he a hammer. In, in addition to him being in the position of authority he was in, as he says in the word, he gave them resources. Yeah. He gave Solomon resources, right? For building the kingdom. So everything that we get as a kingdom of most heathens, right, they'll be funding it. You get what I'm saying? So they're gonna be doing it in the kingdom of heaven. They're gonna be building the kingdom of heaven up, right? It's uh, uh, right. Hi Hiram was too was angry at King Solomon because Solomon he thought he was gonna get more of a reward than what he got. Yeah. So the heathens got a grudge with Israel. Hey, yeah. go get the blessing again. Genesis right. 20. I'll get Let me get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. You got it? Genesis 20. We got to get that blessing, yeah, them, boy. The hand mites, the, the so-called white man, help me build up the kingdom, But man. he put some of us in a position of authority to offset it. You get what I'm saying? Yep. He put us in a position of authority to offset it. We were just talking about that earlier. Uh, 
It was funny though how Israel goes always in the captivity of these other nations that somehow end up in the top on the top. Position. Moses go to Egypt, he's living in the royal house. <laughs> Daniel exactly. go to Persia, yeah. he become the president. Yeah. Who else was there's another one? Uh, exactly. What do we say? That's what's happening. Yeah, right Joseph now. became the Pharaoh. Esther. Yeah. Y'all, yeah. Esther, Mordecai, there's yeah. A, there's a child floating in a, in a, in a bassinet on its way to the on its way to the to the royal gates. Oh, oh shit! So my bad. King David too, because he went to the Persian army. He was hiding from the Persian army. Oh, yeah. like Joseph, believe that. There's yeah, Joseph, one. boy. There's always one. Joseph's here today. There's always one that's floating up to right up to the ranks of the of the east, right? To Can't do what it is that the Abba wants. <laughs> Hey, but you never know. Uh, most high could open someone's eyes. You just don't know. He's man. open his eyes because he's called. He's calling Trump a superbug in front of everybody. Man, he still say uh, Yahweh Shah don't exist. He so. a five percenter. Yeah, most high gonna destroy yeah, that's, that's, that's a scripture too. That's, doesn't believe in any of that. That's some. Nah, he he that's some Satan. You Satan. Yeah. Believe in mammon. Yeah, Pretty much. And, yeah. And what, ha and what has him comfortable? But, but you see, the father's not going to bring a light worker to work to earth and then let him sleep to a place, in a place, because he didn't bring him for that. He brought him so that he would open up his eyes at, at, in a very moment and have to and have to give up those things. Yep. He's going to have to give those things up pretty soon. His comforts are going to be tested. I mean, you got a lot of superstar. Uh, you, you can see a lot of these athletes know the Israelites now. You, know? Oh, you see a lot of them growing their beards out. Uh, uh, yeah, James Harden. Oh, yeah. I don't think James Harden knows. I just think he's just I'll be wondering, Kyrie, no, he is like yeah, Because everybody now, talking. everybody's starting to grow their beards, but why? Well, 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 why? Everybody look. Trump's an easy target, you know. Actually, the scriptures say Trump's not the king. Right. Satan don't Cyrus. mean adversary. It huh? just means a Cyrus. Oh yeah, because yeah. you're supposed to deal wisely when you're speaking about them. Yeah. You know what I mean? He's a Cyrus. So, so the most high is going to use him to open up certain things, and then he's, he's going to his heart's going to stone, stone back over because he used the comforts. See, comfort is going to be the gall for yeah. people who are rich into this time. Comfort is going to be the gall. It's going to end up being a numbing agent when they when they want to when. They're supposed to come fall before him. They're going to want to hold on to their comfort. So you got routine, the church, right? Tradition, the church. Yep. And you have comfort, the rich. So routine, tradition, and comfort are going shit. to be the agent. Yo, that shit. They're going to be the agent that solidifies what Satan has in his case. That's the whole thing with this country. This whole country became too comfortable. Because yep. we really, living was real rough until just, you know, recently. After World War II, everything yep. started getting real comfortable. Yeah. People it got... Rough. People got kept, kept you healthy. People, they got central air conditioning in their houses. I mean, just that alone, that come, you don't leave the house. Everybody cozy. You got heat. Yeah, you got heat. That refrigeration. That refri you know, refrigerator. People who have gardens in their yards. This one they made the pool. I just, I think this one they made the uh, the pool. You know, after World War Two, people get comfortable and shit like that. <laughs> We ain't never comfortable, man. We ain't never comfortable. We just, this ain't our rest right here, man. This is you know, not. You know what I asked him? I asked him, I had his ear. And I asked the father, I said, I said, Abba, what brings you comfort? Because you know what we do for comfort, right? We eat, we lay with our, our ribs, right? We we sit in the room, we enjoy comfort. What is your, he said, love is his comfort. Love is his comfort. The truth is comfort. Hey, the truth hey, is comfort. hey, hey, hey comfort. what's that scripture? Oh, let me get that. I got the scripture for that one, boy. Hold this in that Maccabees. Literally, Hold man, up. This word is just comfort. I got, I got to get that scripture. He is not Jermaine Grant. That is like that. You got to do the bag of Holland Shots, and this is burning his life anyway. We just doing a. We like robots or something. We just program to do what we do. Like, we program to do some stuff. Like, we don't have love. We got love. We got all that. But you know, we show up, people don't understand it. You feel me? Like, this is love right now that we're coming out here. It's time to wake up to the land. I got a fire stripper. First Maccabees 12 and 9. Therefore, we also. Albeit we need none of these things that we have the holy books of scripture in our hands to comfort us. Yes, sir. Comfort, right. Yes, sir. 
That's a good word. Yeah, that's a good scripture right John there. 14 and 26, but the Comforter, which is the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, he shall teach you all things and bring all things into your remembrance, whatsoever I have said unto you. As we come to the new number and for the comfort of the world, as we see what's coming, we see that storm coming. Hey, that's a good point too. That's hey, good. like when we make these videos, like we make these, got a YouTube channel, we trying to wake people up with the videos, trying to teach brothers with the videos, but really the main thing, when you think about it, these videos comfort other brothers, yeah, yeah, right. you know? Right. Like, well, I get comforted by watching yeah. certain brothers, you know, yeah, watching yeah, their videos. Yeah, yeah. It's, I already know everything they already teaching. I already so know. What? I, that song I, is I, yeah, right. But, but it how comforts many, how many you. How times you love a song, you want to hear it over and over? Yeah, because yeah. it comforts you. You know, yeah. that's, that's right. Yep. That's right. It that's ain't a new song. Because sometimes it's not even... It ain't, already, that, it ain't that bullshit. Yeah, it, it, it ain't, it ain't that, that new release yeah. that they released in yeah. the Prince. Because you know they're about to release a lot of his It's shit. like that Pally Gap, boy. You yeah, know, right, you don't get right. tired of Pally Gap, <laughs> you know? Right. You turn that Jimmy on, boy. You don't know about that, see? Some John Coltrane. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Jimmy. That Johnny Coltrane. That's music. Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, I, I, I still rock some. You know what that one song about the, uh, I like the, the children around the world? That's my shit. I, I don't care about the earth yeah, song. That's my, yeah, that's yeah, my yeah. shit. That's my man, too. Wait, it's uh, a yeah. first uh, to the uh, uh, Logians 5 and 11. Yeah, some Wherefore, Davis. comfort Ooh. yourselves together and edify one another, even as you do also. Yo. Oh yeah, but well, they okay. Come on, man. Who that? Who talking Carl about? Carl Thomas for like the new. Yeah, but I can't, I can't get into it, man. It's too watered down to me. What is it? You talking about? When I listen to it, it sounds super jazz. It sounds, oh, sounds jazz. too watered down. To me. I don't really mess with jazz. Yeah, he's nice though. I don't say he's he's a good musician, but I don't. I like the blues, baby. Just not too much of that that spirit of the new world in him, man. I, it's I that know, comfort spirit. We, see, we got that ancient spirit in us, man. We like that old shit. I like, I got, my music got to be dirty. I like we it like dirty. Old stuff, bro. Like, like, uh, I like, even, even I like old, Chicago blues, like Muddy Waters. Yeah, it's dirty. Even, even old gospel from the, from the 50s and the 60s is old. See, we, see, we probably more like Y generation. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Y generation, probably millennials, right? But, I, but when I grew up, though. Yeah. Herbie Mann. You gotta listen to some Herbie Man. I'm in between y'all, probably y'all too. I'm like, why y'all? Oh, you want? Oh, some, some. Uh, what, people what? think it's man. You want to hear somebody in the spirit on the flute, man? The spirit. The flute. The flute. The flute. You ain't heard nothing like it till you heard some flute. Herbie Man. Damn. And Damn. motherfucker, why you like see me like? Is that fear? What's that one boy? Look, her, 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 uh, IUIC be like that's the Edomite. Like. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah they you will. Know, listen to yeah. some Herbie Man. It'll blow your mind, man. It'll blow right your here. mind. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm over like everybody's delegation of what is acceptable, what is it? Oh. Who, who is every who, who this this person should be in this box, this person should be in this right. box, this person should be in this box. You know, and, and really the only the only thing that you could just to do to find out who's gonna be who is with time. Try the spirit. Yeah, in the spirit. Hey, what's that uh Romans 8 said, you know, we know by the spirit that we are the sons of God. Yeah, sure. It's all the spiritual. Hey, like hey, we go back to Jimi Hendrix. Look at Jimi Hendrix. Uh his drummer, Mitch Mitchell, the white boy, they had they had chemistry, you know? They had a they was like brothers, you know? But people look at uh Mitch Mitchell on oh, that goddamn cracker. You know what I mean? Oh, you know, I, you wanna hear some bad shit? Y'all know who Paul Reed Smith is? Uh he got his own get look up, he did a cover, he did a cover of Machine Gun by Jimi Hendrix. Yeah. Good look it up on YouTube, that's some bad shit. But his whole band ain't nothing but Judah, Judites. He's a white dude. With the whole band, they even got a female singer. But you can see they was all like brothers, though. You know, you, well, you don't know the difference, man. You yeah, yeah, you, yeah. You understand, and at times you really understand like where all of that division comes from. That spirit, you're gonna know somebody who is with the spirit of the Most High. Yep. And somebody who's not. So who all got ribs here? I got that. What's that? Who all have ribs? I'm married to the loud. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I got, I got wives, but I ain't with them. Hold up, I ain't got no money. I got no woman. <laughs> you gotta operate like a unit. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna go get one later tonight on Sullivan. It's like, nah, I'm just playing. <laughs> you know what, man? If you just set yourself apart, this is the, you know, I'm not into just giving random, going out random words. You know how they do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
people, but I feel like I feel like you are, you know, it's telling me like you have to be setting yourself apart. Somebody want to know this when they hear. It. Prepare yourself for your future because this what this is this is season for her. She will show up. Right in the Most High, going. He will literally ha leave a, leave a woman at your doorstep if he really wants you to have one. Yeah. Yeah, and. and I, told, I, told, I always told brothers, be careful what you ask for, too. <laughs> no, I remember Apostle Kabbalah said, I need this, too. He prayed for a woman, and then he prayed for the Lord to take the woman away. It's like, hey, that was me. You know what? I, I, didn't, I didn't go to that extreme of taking her away, because I was like, you know what? I might have a long suffer love with her. Yeah, yeah. But then, he, but then he was like, I'm going to cut away everything that's not for you. And 